All right, this is my unsolicited, unbiased, non-compensated, I don't give a fly and flip review series on the Flow Pro Downstream Remote Control Thingamabob. This is supposed to be a game changer, life changer like having a religious experience or something. I mean, the way people are talking about this. I'm going to do an unboxing video today. Then later, I'm going to do a video installation video. And then I'm going to do a field test. And then probably, periodically, I will do update videos. I want to get the lowdown on this. And again, this is totally unbiased. I know uh, Judd only by virtue of social media. We've never met. He gave me permission to make the video series, though he didn't ask me to do it. Um, and again, I'm not being compensated. So uh, I have not seen this yet. The purchase price is around $600 uh, plus some change. And uh, here we go. All right, there you have that. Take a screenshot. On the record, real quickly, let me say that the, um, the communication has been amazing. He's answered every question uh, via private messenger and live on Facebook or through social media. And uh, I cannot say enough about communication. He's answered every question, and I've, I've bugged him about this. So I'm not known to bug people. Just so you know. Quite heavy. Quite heavy. Ooh, break it, Mike. Break it. We have a sticker pack. No, this is the uh, remote control um, carrying case. The remote control. Heavy duty coaxial style um, cables. Here we have the actuator that actually connects over really the um, ball valve but the ball valve is actually inside the actuator i believe jed told me that everything is covered under a one-year warranty with the exception of the actual ball valve so very, very interesting. And then the control panel. Darn that UPS guy. LED lights. That's pretty cool. A second remote. I didn't know I was getting two remotes. If I'm supposed to send one of these back, let me know. Or don't. I'll keep it. Um, on the inside, we've got an Allen wrench. And then I suppose that somewhere there are some screws. Otherwise, this is just going to pop right off. It's supposed to be like that, Jed? Oh, there they are. I see them. There they are. They're there. There's the screw or the, uh, the nuts for that. So all is well. Nothing is lost. There's what we have on the inside. And uh, seems quite self-explanatory. I will tell you that this is very, very heavy. And this is made very, very well. There's an on and off switch at the bottom. Underneath. Um, constructed very, very well. Hard plastic. And I'm very impressed with the gauge and strength of the um, cables. All right, so there you have it. Uh, so far, so good. Feel free to ask questions, and I'll do my best to answer them. Our next video will be on installation. Jed says that it should take five to ten minutes. I'm not going to hold him to that for good reason. One, I'm slow. Secondly, I'll be videoing. 
moving the camera around, all that good stuff. I want to really show how to how I'm going to install it. You may do it differently. And I'm um, going to put some effort into that. So I'm not going to hold him to that 10 minute uh, installation time. It may take me a while, but I'm excited about this. So thanks again for watching. Uh, like and subscribe for more upcoming videos. And again, Flow Pro Solution, Flow Pro dot Solution. Screenshot that. 600 ish and change. Peace out.